Believe it or not, the fall semester is getting ready to begin here at Montana Tech in Butte, and hundreds of new freshmen are moving into their new dorms. This is going to be your ticket to go get your keys, so make sure you fill all of this out. If you don't have your student ID, there are a lot of students that come in with their anxious. I mean, there was one student that told me he was so excited that he wanted to do cartwheels, but he was also so nauseated that he felt like he might throw up. So <laughs> I said, "That's normal. That's you know, that's what it's that's what it's supposed to be like when it's a new experience." It's also a nerve-wracking experience for many parents watching their children go off on their own for the first time. Oh, it's going to be terrible. <laughs> I'm going to miss her like crazy. I'm definitely one of those moms that would keep my kids forever if I could. Her daughter, Karina, is only 17 and excited to leave the nest, even though it will be tough on mom. I'm sure she'll cry the two hours home. <laughs> My sister will get to deal with that and get to comfort her, but <laughs> yeah. She's eager to move her belongings into her room, including one very important item. Well, for today, I think it's my fan. <laughs> it's so hot up there on the fourth floor. <laughs> Many students were, uh, hold on a second. I'll help out. I can't just sit and let you carry this by yourself. So hang on. Let me do my duty. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Yep. What do you got in here? An elephant? Yep. Holy. <laughs> they, you just need a mini refrigerator, not a full one. <laughs> wow. Whew. Okay. That was a heavy load. And she was on the fourth floor, but no big deal. This is a big time in these students' lives. So any little help they can get is a really good thing. Now I'm going to go lay down somewhere. My first day coming in was wild. <laughs> it, was, it was set up a little bit differently, but it was definitely like a lot at once. So we're, we're doing this with in mind, trying to break it down for students so they have an easier time moving into the halls. And hopefully they'll all be settled in before classes begin on August 22nd. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.